Hi, so today I'm going to talk about um, ser using the servos. Um, so servos um, are sort of like motors um, in that they move, uh, but the main difference is they have a limited range, whereas a motor can, can rotate um, continuously um, at, at a set power, Basically, all a servo does is just change positions. Um, it doesn't have a full 360 degree range of motion. It's um, um, range of values is 0 to 255. So, first off, I'm going to need to write down that range for you. Um, um, Servo range equals zero to two fifty five. Okay. So first thing you want to we want to do um, to start using servos is go to motors and sensors set up and then external controllers and then what we're going to do is add a um, servo controller um, to port 2 on the NXT um, and we're going to hit apply down here and then if we go to this servos tab uh, we can see there are now servos equipped. Um, basically, we are going to add on a standard servo. We only have standard servos uh, at the moment. Um, and we'll, I'll call it servo A, just because we have only one servo to demonstrate this code. And you can see that that change is reflected in the header code. So now we are going to write server code. Okay, so another important thing to note about the servos is that um, you generally don't want to um, set them to um, values all the way at the end so of the ranges because that'll definitely damage the hardware um, so probably um, I I don't know m minus maybe 25 and 230 are good max and somewhat better max and min values for the hardware, I guess. So, but anyway, so how you write servo code um, is first off, you will do servo and then open square bracket and then the name of the servo in this case servo A I believe and then close square bracket and then equals and then the position um, in that range you want to go with I'll do 160 and then and It should be working. I'm not sure why the compiler isn't. Oh, wait, I think I know why. This might work. Do I need to compile it, maybe? Okay, well. Hmm. 
Okay, well, I have no idea why it wasn't... why server A wasn't showing up as a variable before, but now it is. Um, and I guess the compiler took needed to take was sort of lagging or something. Anyway, that's basically how you write server code.